What is up guys, it's Soul Bash, and we're here today with a different type of video. Uh, this is a website called Big Knox, and uh, Knox is an app player, basically emulates the Android system. And what we are going to do today is show you how to download this, how to get it installed, and exactly what it's going to do. Now to get to the website, I will leave you a link in the description below, it is BigKnox.com. It's the English version. This is still very early stages of beta. It just came out a week and a half or so ago. But you're gonna click here, click download, and you're gonna have a box pop up. Just click save, and it's going to go to your downloads right here, and you're going to run this. And when you run this, it's going to let you install the game. It's going to bring up a window. You're going to download everything, and it's going to install it for you and once you get everything installed you're going to have these right here come up this right here is where you open the program up I already have one up and running right here and as you can see it emulates the look of the Android system perfectly now the one thing I do like about this is it is completely resizable I see there's where it's trying to uh, install no I'm not going to do that but it's completely resizable and it's got every feature that you would have on an Android device. You've got your browser right here, everything loads up just perfectly, goes straight to the internet, home button, you got your Play Store, you can search for your favorite games. Of course, Tai Chi Panda was the first one that I got. And I mean, it's got everything that you would wish. And you've also got little side menus over here. Uh, it's customizable keyboard control. I'll show you how to use that in just a minute. Screen captures, your location, your computer where you can import files. You can also make this full screen just like so. Escape to get back out of that. Your volume controls, mute. This closes the application that you're currently in and you can add an AP, APK file. But the also neat feature with this is you can just drag and drop from your desktop the APK files and it automatically installs them to the system. Now you do have a settings tab right here for general settings where you can turn it on to run it startup on or off your keyboard controls. Advanced settings, uh, this is very unique. Uh, you have low, middle, and high settings, and you can also customize it to run on however many CPUs and RAM, as much RAM as you would like. So it's very unique. Startup settings, you can uh, make it come up as a tablet or a phone and whichever resolution you would like to use. Save those, reset it, and everything will come up fine. I believe I already have been playing Tai Chi Panda right here. Yes, I have. We're going to get into it. I'll show you some of these features that I was talking about. For instance, this right here. This is the keyboard. Uh, since you are on a PC, everything is controlled you know, with your keyboard and mouse. Okay and normally you're right here moving around so you can click here and that right there you can move it around wherever you want but it's gonna be somewhere right around in here you know you're gonna have to get your directions correct and as you can see here I've already got some set up you can have these any way which form or fashion you like them uh, but I have spacebar set up as the auto attack and then just one two three four five and six on my numeric pad just for the controls and you can save those and it'll tell you the settings are complete and everything works fine auto attack and uh, of course you can always just click them and that's one thing I'll generally like doing auto play works everything fine and just go through here running and farming stuff on your PC how awesome is this now anything other than this um, guys you can run pretty much anything it's also got another feature it's called multi um, I'm gonna minimize this real quick called multi drive basically what it is you open it up and you can add more than one emulator running at the same time you see I have one Knox here this one is running already and Knox one which is off currently I can start that one up and it will open up another player just like this but it will have stuff separate 
from what I already have on here. So it will basically be like it's loading a second Android device onto my computer. They run multiple. Um, if you have a good enough PC, you can run up to three or four of them if you want to. But guys, I just wanted to share this with you today and uh, just show you how awesome this thing is and I will be using it quite a bit to do live streaming and possibly quite a bit of my recordings because it makes things so much easier to do and if you are interested in getting this program like I said the link it will be left in the description below guys and as always like comment and subscribe I am Soulbash. you guys have a nice day